Hey guys, so this video is going to be followed by a bunch of other videos, which is going to be a series of me making outfits for my little fashion show that I'm having. Also, this fashion show, it is little because it's in like a month <laughs> and I have to make eight outfits, which is why the models that I've chosen are little kids, like literally four years old up to teenagers but i have to make eight outfits in a month i think i can do it i'm confident that i can do it okay and this fashion show is like a, a little cultural event and i have and i have a couple of ideas these are like the themes that i'm trying to make the outfit around like this is the idea but we'll see and i want the color palette to be more like red pink beige champagne rose oil you know that kind of that kind of palette but that's also subject to change so i don't know and now i'm gonna go shopping for this outfit this is what i am thinking of making but we will see what i actually end up making and i've set timelines for myself so that i can get it outfits done and i have two days to make this outfit so let's go shopping I'm in Joann's and these are all the fabrics. I'm trying to look for like pink ones, but they're kind of expensive. Look at what I found you guys. That too, this is literally on sale. Like, are you kidding? It's so pretty. I found this pink one that goes really nice with this. This as a top and then this as a border for the top. I got the fabrics look how pretty it is i love it this is for the skirt by the way yeah and then this is for the top i know pretty simple but i wanted to keep it simple because the skirt's like shiny a little bit you know so i got this little flower thing this is kind of expensive so i only got this much to put in the front but actually it might be enough to put in the front and the back so we will see but now i'm gonna start off by making the skirt circle skirt so it's just like simple circle skirt that you guys have seen make like a thousand times i know i know it's boring i'm sorry okay i'll speed through it plus this one is for like a four-year-old so it shouldn't be too bad it shouldn't take too long this isn't an outfit by me if i don't make a mistake somehow somewhere <laughs> So basically, with this one, I made the length a little bit longer on purpose, just to see. Because you can always make it shorter, but you can't make it longer. So, that was fine. But the waist, it literally did not fit. And I was like, oh my. I'm done with the first the skirt for the first outfit. And this is what it looks like. And one second. It's for a four-year-old, which is why it looks so short but sequin shimmery love it and the blouse which is essentially just like a long tank top that's gonna have flower border is the same color as this pink in here and so are the flowers so it's gonna look super cute and lucky i already started cutting it like right there <laughs> but i'm gonna film the rest of the process and once i'm done i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on the model and then once all my outfits for all my models are done i'm gonna show you guys the final looks and like a cute little video so mm -hmm. since this was the first outfit i made i was so stressed that i forgot to record most of it oops but here's what the first fitting looks like that i did with my model so by that two second video that you guys saw i couldn't like take a lot of videos sorry i was like trying to figure out how to make it fit better on her so that was the fitting that was like the initial fitting and there are adjustments that I have to make and still add the flower and do pearls maybe. So we got to do that. I oiled my hair, so we're going to ignore that. But I literally took apart the whole top because I added two layers. I didn't want two layers because it was looking bulky. Like my model, like the four-year-old, she was looking like an army soldier, right? And I was like, ooh. So it's all just one layer now. I took it apart. Now I'm going to re-sew it. This wasn't that hard, just more tedious, I would say. And then the one side, like, 
made the sleeve shorter and just connected everything together i added the piping to the neckline which really didn't even matter because then i ended up adding these flowers i was so scared that the flowers would end up looking flat but i figured a way around that i'm done with the outfit finally feels like i did this forever i decided to add the flowers near the neckline and the bottom too look how cute this looks are you kidding me oh my god and then this is what the skirt looks like like this just a sequin white and pink and i'm gonna do a final fitting and i'm gonna take a video of that for you guys also and then and then i should be done with this outfit and then we can move on to look number two and this is the final fitting she looks so cute so that was the making of the first look i hope you guys liked the style of filming i don't even know if it was different or not in my mind it was i don't know if for you guys if it was or not but i have gotten the feedback that that this outfit that i just made the first one is a bit simple like especially on the top like the flowers are cute but it looks a little bit plain i've gotten that feedback so it's not a completely done outfit. I might add pearls to the top or something. I'm not sure. But for the most part, it's done. So now it's time to move on to the second look. <laughs>